Hey everybody, JSLA here again, and today it's gonna be a little bit of a rough video to do because in this next movie news update, which will be concerning the film Justice League, which is coming out on November 17th, directed by Zack Snyder, um, there seems to be a little bit of a problem. Now, it doesn't have to do anything with the filming. I mean, that already wrapped up. Nor the writing, nor post-production or anything. It concerns the director himself, Zack Snyder, who also directed Man of Steel and Batman v Superman, Dawn of Justice. Now, I'm not a big fan of his because I'm not really grasping his storytelling. Even in Man of Steel, which I enjoyed, I didn't think that he did a perfect job at the storytelling and he did a little bit worse in BVS but overall I still have faith in the guy and I still want to see what he's able to bring to Justice League if he's able to get up to standards to Man of Steel or if not better than Man of Steel but it looks like I would not be seeing that for or partially part of the movie because Zack Snyder has stepped down as director of the entire film. Now, this had no concern with the studio execs or anything. It concerned the suicide of his daughter, Autumn Snyder. And I can really understand it. I mean, I feel so bad for him, actually. Um, stepping down will probably be the good re the good reason because after just when Justice League is gonna be almost around the corner and he's still there to direct, there's gonna be a lot of pressure with the spotlight on him. There gonna be people who are trying to hate on him and all that stuff. So if he still kept on trying to direct the film and promote it it could be really hard for him to do it because not a lot of people have known, but the suicide started in March. And we haven't known until May now. So if we haven't known until November, it could be a lot of pressure for Zack Snyder. And it could be really tough for his life. So I understand why he would step down as director. Thankfully... He had a black backup. I'm I'm sorry. I'm at a loss for words. Uh, he had a backup plan. And the replacement for directing Just League is none other than the great Josh Whedon, who directed the Avengers and its sequel. Now, is this a good choice? Well, in terms of character and story element and visual stuff, I think Josh Whedon is a great choice. I really think he could bring the same levity of greatness as Zack Snyder is promoting in the trailers. So Josh Whedon is a really good pick. And it seems like everything is going out of the backup plan is going well. So I pray for Zack Snyder that he gets well. And I hope that Justice League will do good. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.